Hi everyone, thank you so much for joining me. So today I've got a full body Pilates workout for us to do together. The first part of the class will be cardio Pilates, so great for toning and burning calories and for weight loss. And the second part is gonna focus on arms and chest, abs and thighs. So roll out your mat and we'll get started. All right, so we're gonna begin with our single leg stretch. So arms up and we're gonna add a twist to it. So mirroring me, we're gonna take the left knee up and then stretch the arms out and then the right. Good, a nice twist, get that knee right up for thighs and buttocks and then other leg. Let's go for six more. And just keeping a smooth and steady breath. Five more, and a nice twist through the belly. Four. Good, make sure you get the arms right up with the shoulders down. Three more. And other leg. Two. And our final one. And the other leg, well done. Relaxing the arms down. Now for a standing double leg stretch, we're gonna reach those arms up and we're gonna take the arms back, bend deep, and then stretch right up. So we're gonna pump the arms for triceps and a full body stretch. Good, six, we're getting that heart rate up. Five, working thighs and glutes and stretching. Four, three more, good, and extend, two, and our final one, let's stay here. We're just gonna pump those arms. Good, bend nice and deep, arms in front, and let's hold. And then stretch right up, arms release down. Moving into standing triangle. So mirroring me with our right leg, we're gonna take the foot up to the side, and then down to first position. Six more, and arms float with the leg, sculpting those arms, five more. Four, and challenging our balance, three, two, final one. And now we'll go the other way. Same leg, arms up. Now we go to the side and down. So we're still with that right leg. Arms are still floating with that leg. Six more, five, good. You wanna keep that back long for it. Don't let the tailbone curl under. Three, two, and one, good, let's get the leg right up, pull the shoulders down and a little bit of a pulse through the leg. Arms are slightly bent, hold, and relax right down. Let's do our left leg. So we go forward to the side and down. Good, six more, keeping good posture, five. Imagine you're balancing a book on your head, four more, three, two and one and now the other way same leg now to the side forward and down to the side really good sculpting for the thigh getting inner outer thigh quad hamstring working the butt buttocks the abs the obliques full body sculpting good keep breathing keep good posture good forward down and now the legs up, shoulders down. Let's add a little bit of a pulse here. Good. And now a hold and release down. All right, moving right along. We're gonna bend nice and deep, arms out, and let's add a twist. We're gonna twist to the right leg, twist to the left leg, and down we go, open through the shoulders and chest. And I squeeze through the belly, trimming through the waist and the belly, working the thighs and the glutes. Shoulders down, so we've got six more. Back is long when you're twisting. Five more. Good, elbows wide and down. Four more. Three. Two. And one. Good, twist and twist. And now we're gonna go down, let's hold. Bend nice and deep. Heating up the thighs, the glutes, good. Stretch up, arms go down. Now for around the world squats. We're gonna open the legs, heels inwards, toes outwards. Let's bend nice and deep. Imagine you're holding a medicine ball and then you're tossing it over to your shoulder. 
We're alternating here to the right, bend deep, knees facing the same direction as the toes, six more. Bend and extend to the side, five more, you got it. And extend, four more, nice stretch for the hips as well, good, three more. And other side, we've got two. And our final one. Good, all right, let's bend deep, arms in front, right onto the toes. And we're gonna hold a little bit of a pulse if you like. Breathe it through and stretch up, relax the arms down, well done. All right, now stretching those arms right up, let's go down and we're gonna walk the hands forward in a downward facing dog. And now pausing, let's move into a plank. Hold in plank, good, breathe it through, shoulders above the wrist and releasing right down. Relaxing in a child's pose, sinking back into your heels, relax your thighs, your glutes, all the muscles down the back. All right, so now from here, let's move into cat position. We're taking the right leg out to the side and next we're gonna lift it up and then a push up and down. So out to the side and then back and up and push up. You got it, eight more. Getting arms and chest, thighs and buttocks, seven more. Good, right out to the side. Legs straight right through, six more. Five. Four, and keeping that neck long. Three. Two. Our final one. All right, so now let's go six push-ups in a row. Keep that leg nice and straight. Good. That's it. And now we'll go down and hold. We're gonna bend the leg a little bit of a pulse. Really great for the bottom part of the buttocks. And now extend the leg, hold. Good. We're gonna come up and let's take a stretch in child's pose. Pressing back into our heels. All right, so now let's go to our left leg. So extending that left leg out and then we're gonna take it out to the side, back up, and then add our push-up. So our hands are slightly outside of the, the shoulders, getting a little more chest this way. Good, eight more. Seven, keeping the leg straight. Six, and that neck is long. Five, and the abs are engaged. Breathing it through, we got this, four more. Three, really feeling the arms and chest heating up, thighs and glutes, two. One. All right, let's go six push-ups in a row, keeping that leg straight. Good. And now we're gonna hold, bend the leg, a little bit of a pulse. Heating up the bottom part of the buttocks, firming that area up. And now extend the leg and hold. Good, let's come up and a child's pose back again. Well done. Well, let's walk the hands over to one side, leaning into one hip. We're gonna go to the center and we're gonna walk the hands to the other side, leaning into the other hip. Good, back to the center. And then from here, let's come up. Preparing to do some work in teaser. So we're gonna sit up really tall. We'll just have the hands back and we're gonna bend the legs and extend. Really important, we keep the back long here. We don't sink into the lower back. You could always go into the elbows if you feel it in your lower back or tailbone. And let's really stretch those legs long, squeeze those thighs. And now crossing the legs, cross, cross, and open. Good. Working thighs and abs, especially those lower abs. Good, cross, cross, and open. And now just holding. If you like a little more challenging, grab hold of the legs. Breathing it through, back is long, legs are long. Good, release the legs down, stretch the back long, hug the legs, and then we're gonna roll the back and then straighten. Good, extend, and let's continue. So now, hands place back, we're gonna go to one side. So let's twist towards the right. So that left hip is lifted, and what we're doing here is still getting thighs, abs, and glutes, but getting those obliques. Good to trim through the waist. Let's try to fully extend the legs, and now crossing. Just crossing those legs, keep them straight, reaching through the toes. We're gonna hold, good. 
And let's go to the other side now. So see, notice my right hip is up now. So there's a little twist through the belly. This you can do on the elbows as well and pressing evenly down on both hands. Fully extending those legs. Back stays long. Good. Crossing the legs now. Legs are fully extending. Just crossing. You can always just hold if you prefer. And now we'll all hold. Straighten those legs. Good work. Pull the knees into the chest. Stretch that back long. Good work. All right. Let's sit up nice and tall. We're going to extend those legs out. And we're going to do a variation of saw. Arms out. We're going to twist and then reach the arms up and then twist. So we're going opposite arm to the leg. Arms extend and twist. Really great stretch, but still trimming through the belly, working those arms, stretch and extend. A great exercise, not only to stretch, but great for toning and slimming through the belly and in the waist. Good, twist and extend and twist and extend. Well done, keep going and stretch those arms out and hold a little longer now we're going to come up hold and then we'll go to the other side holding a little longer stretch those arms out and relax the arms down walk the hands forward now we'll flex the feet so we'll do a gentle stretch forward breathing it through let's walk the hands up and we'll make a diamond shape with the legs feet together knees apart and walking forward again Walk the hands back up. We'll pull the feet right in and butterfly. Palms together. Inhale the arms up and exhale. Breathing in and out one more time. And exhale. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed that. And I hope to see you again soon. Take care.